have something super um, delicious and super easy to make um, today, which is going to be a vegan chocolate pudding. Very easy, um, really doesn't take that much time at all. So we're doing this with avocados. Um, we're also using agave. We're using cacao powder. We're using coconut oil and a little bit of plant milk, um, coconut milk, almond milk, whatever it is that you wanna use. So you just have your avocados and then throw the knife in the pit, get rid of it. And then, I mean, actually we don't even have to score it. I'm used to scoring them because I eat them like this all the time. So you just take a spoon and you're just gonna scoop out the avocado filling. I'm gonna do that to four avocados and then work on the rest of our recipe. So it doesn't matter much um, what order you do this in. I'm just spooning my avocado into the blender. And you can use like the, um, the Nutribullet as well, but that's, um, those cups are a little smaller and I'm making like a bigger batch so get all of this in here and then what i have to the side is i have two tablespoons of cacao powder i have one tablespoon of coconut oil i have a quarter of a cup of agave and then i have a half a cup of um any plant-based milk that you're looking to use I like coconut, I like almonds, I like oat milk. So pretty much whatever you have on hand. You can use unsweetened, plain, you can use sweetened, vanilla, coconut milk, you know, whatever your, your preference. So we have almost all our avocado in here. Now the half a cup of plant milk. Um, the last time I made this, I didn't use plant milk. And it took just a little while to blend, so I wanted to add like a creamier texture to the pudding. So I'm going to incorporate it um, pretty much about a tablespoon at a time because I don't want it to come out too creamy or too, um, you know, liquidy. And then I'm gonna have to, which thankfully I do have more avocado. So if I had to add more avocado, then we could just do that. So we have your cacao powder and a quarter cup of agave. And then if it's not sweet enough for you, if you want more of a chocolatey flavor, you can always add like, you know, about a teaspoon at a time of more cacao powder. Or if you want it sweeter, <coughs> excuse me, you can add more agave. Um, you can use uh, date sugar if you wanna make your own date sugar. I do, I always have some on hand. Um, because we do eat um, an alkaline based diet a lot of us do in this house so I use that a lot so then we're just gonna put this on high incorporated at the bottom so we could all mix in together so I'm going to add a little bit more of the um, cacao powder to it about a half no I'm gonna do a full tablespoon in there get that going in there I'm gonna give it a little taste before I decide to add more agave because it might be sweet enough It could be a little sweeter, so. So what we're gonna go for is a half a cup of agave for this recipe instead of a quarter cup. And also three tablespoons of cacao powder 
versus the two tablespoons. And then it is going to be a half a cup of plant milk. And then I should get it blended up more. It was a little too solidified and everything wasn't mixing in together. So adding some more coconut milk is going to do the trick. one more little mix but it's the color that I'm looking for I could tell how sweet it was before I added that last bit of agave and the texture the smoothness everything's everything's working it's perfect so I'm gonna give it another quick mix and then I'm going to put it in a bowl for you guys to see the finished product so for a finished product, like I said, I just gave it up um, another quick blend. Um, just wanted to make sure that the texture, the color, the taste, everything was perfect. So you really feel like you're um, eating chocolate pudding. So this is our finished product. You know, just like pudding, the taste is there. The sweetness, that extra half a cup of agave was absolutely, um, I'm sorry, extra quarter cup of agave was absolutely what we needed so there you have your pudding and you know this is a super quick dessert it didn't even take me 10 minutes to do and it would have been even quicker if I had the right measurements to begin with so it's like eating chocolate pudding <laughs> it's really like eating chocolate pudding it's great um, this is going to go by today. Everyone in my house, I mean, this wasn't a big enough um, portion that I made. So just to be clear, what I did was, is I used four avocados, spoon the mixture out. I ended up using three tablespoons of cacao powder, a half a cup of any plant-based milk. Um, I used vanilla almond, uh, vanilla coconut milk. I used one tablespoon of coconut oil and I ended up using a half a cup. I started out with a quarter of a cup, but it needed more sweetness. So super easy guys. I mean, these, these few um, ingredients and like I said, not even 10 minutes. So please um, make it, comment, tell me, tell me how you felt about it, how much you loved it, anything that you've incorporated with it. If you want to mix it, you know, um, make some whipped cream with aquafaba or something like that, which I'm going to tackle as well. I haven't tried it yet. So please like, share, and subscribe, turn your notifications on, and I'll see you on the next one, guys. Thank you and have a great day.